You guys ready to see it? Okay. Here goes. Hey everybody, welcome to the studio. Today is Thursday, November 2nd. And behind me, there is a piece of paper that I have prepped. I used my projector to transfer a familiar image onto this piece of paper. And I've got my iPad here, my Holbein gouache. I got some paint water over there and we're just gonna dive in to painting this now I have only painted one other thing so far with this squash so it's a bit soon for me to be tackling something so huge but I mean I'm gonna do it anyway so I'm gonna bring you along for the ride of the plan for the piece and it's very colorful very vibrant and I'm hoping it comes across as such when I am done. I have no idea how long this is going to take, but this is the beginning. So here's my overall setup for today and we're, I'm just, you know what, we're just going to get started because I'm always nervous when I first start a painting. And this time is no different, so the way I usually tackle that is to just get started.
Hello and welcome. So I'm going to get the studio all set up for a marathon painting session. I plan to be in the studio all day today just working on the painting and recording the process for us all to just look at and possibly see where I went wrong or maybe where I went right. I don't know. I, I don't know how I feel about it right now. Um, it's way too early to tell. So I want to get my projector set up because I will be watching some YouTube videos and whatever else. Uh, in the background, um, I have a candle that I would like to light and just want to get my water, my brushes, paper towels, all that stuff set up so I can just settle in and I thought it might be cool for you guys to see a little bit of what my setup looks like when I am doing a painting day in the studio. And it has changed a little bit because I just recently had the exhibit and I kind of, you know, I showed you guys. I redecorated it a little bit. So I have made this projector a, it's here. So I've made this a permanent setup. And so when I'm painting, I hook up my phone to it and I play YouTube videos and it's nice because normally I, I just sit at the table and I have like either my iPad or my phone and it's kind of like more distracting that way because it's like right there if I'm painting then I look down and then it's like I get absorbed in it and it's like oh I stopped painting <laughs> and so I like to limit my distractions and I feel like sitting over here and then having something playing over there it's nice and quiet and it's like in the background it's not as distracting and so um yeah that's that and I feel like there was something else I was going to show you but I really don't remember what that was so it must not be important I guess I don't know so <laughs> so the trick for me in picking a video is I pick one obviously that I want to watch not one that's going to distract me too much I've been watching this girl play Starfield. What would be great is if I could get like something to block the light <laughs> so I can see it a little better. Or I turn the lights off so I can see that a little bit better and I'm just gonna have to make sure it doesn't mess with my setup over here too much so let me grab the painting okay, anyway
Hey guys, happy Monday. Um, it is currently, I don't know, like 10 something, I think close to 11, and I've just been kind of playing around. <laughs> I've kind of just been playing around with the painting, um, and it's getting to the point where I need to paint the leaves on the trees, and I have waited way too long. <laughs> Most of the trees you can see, there's a dead one behind me. There's like no leaves left on them, but it's nice. It's sunny. It's not that cold. So I wanted to go for a walk and then I got to get a couple groceries. I got to stop at the studio for something. Now we're going to go for a walk and hopefully get some pretty pictures. I don't know where to look. Um, and yeah, I'm going to bring you along for the adventure.